Do See if we can chase down those. Ugh. I'm sorry, what? I think you're a bit crazy there. If I have to double trust down Austria, I will. There's no way that Austria dishonors that, right? Very good. Okay, <clears throat> we can consolidate back down now. Not so far over the force limit. Indeed, not over the force limit at all. And now that your armies are all gone, you're willing to go away. I'm willing to have you go away. You go help my vassal, desiege my fort. These guys split across here. And then we have a look at how much it's going to cost to eat up all this. I can't because it's occupied. Joy. <sighs> Continue trusting you down. Because I do not want to get attacked and my alliance with you broken up. Good, that's really useful when we're doing an AE war. Look at any accesses we don't need, like Saxe-Lomburg. Eliminate that. Uh, Switzerland. Hess, Lanchet, Waldegast. I mean, I'm kind of at the point of giving up Hess. I should milk them for more soldiers, at least. And ducats. And a single bit of ally insurance on the fort would be sensible. You couldn't possibly piece them out in the same month, could you? Ugh. No, you had to let them get a reinforcement tick. Just to be annoying. But now we can look at how much aggressive expansion this will be. <clears throat> Honestly, a manageable amount. I might want to think about developing another claim here and declaring on that as well. I'm sorry, you what? He's being a... Oh, Geneva finally declared their independence. And they're helping defend. Fair enough.
Holy. Oh, they're in the trade league. Yeah, okay. As long as as long as Brandenburg can't eat them up at the moment, that's fine. And yet still the Swiss are planning to attack in the middle of this war we get a pop-up saying the Swiss are planning to attack Milan. <laughs> Look. <laughs> He's crazy as what he ooh, is. He needs me to take a dip tech now. Or for my uh, annexed other people's thing to go away. Which does go away mid next year. Take the prestige. I'm also earning enough money. And I want the manpower. The TO is reduced to a OPM in the Empire. That makes me want to co-belligerent them when I attack here. And vassalize them as well. I'm sure Austria would be a big help against Poland, and then we can just go... Feed, 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 feed. And then we could actually form Prussia. Well. Although, as I said, we have to stay Saxony, but still. <clears throat> we could, in theory, form Prussia. Yeah, you just form Saxony again later. Oh! I hadn't thought of that. Uh, I think you have to not be Saxony before, though, right? Most of those things have, you haven't been this tag before. Yeah, and you have to never be a German regional tag. So you can't be Prussia. Well, more accurately, you can't go Prussia into Saxony. You'd have to have something in between. <clears throat> like a Croatia or something. And it says was never a German regional tag, which might be wrong, but... Germans are hard, unlike Italians. We, we might have found a little bit of an escape in that if you are any of the little French guys that gets turned into France in their mission tree, if you use that, you can potentially avoid being an endgame tag. Like, you can escape from being an endgame tag to being France again. But why you'd want to form an endgame tag and not get their missions or their traditions... It would have to be one that gave you, like, free perma claims on a region when you form it. Does it forget tags you formed when you form... I haven't tested that. That would be something to test, Hasia. So you're saying, like, maybe we could... You could use that to form one German regional tag, click the button, and then form another German regional tag. I doubt it would make them forget. But maybe. Who knows?
You've gotten a PU over Arnsbach and Babe Ruth. Sure. We could also go do that war. Hess, you are so useless. Now, the other thing is, once I touch his friends with Burgundy, uh, I was going to say we can maybe try and get Glossar to stop supporting that independence in a second, but not if they're friends with Burgundy. Okay, we eat everything. Goodbye. Goodbye, goodbye. Num, num, num. And back to training. Brandenburg detects my spy, because of course they do. Which means we can go back to currying here, then pay down our favour. You want to be my friend now? Because I eliminated the person that you didn't... that was preventing us from being friends. You do still want to eat parts of uh, BB, so that's okay. So we could do this... I call in this, promise you land, I'll give you these two, take this for me, vassalize that, and vassalize that. That seems very doable. So who does that bring us to war with? Ah, the problem would be that he probably really, really wants the TO. So I would have to say this is mine. Good. Uh, and then I want that one. You can have the rest. Who does it bring us to war with? Hey, MP Moorhead. How you doing? <laughs> we are tall Saxony. We've gone up. We have. Uh, do I even need to co-belligerent the TO? The Livonians are pretty big. Yeah, I don't want the... I'll just pay the extra the extra AE for doing that. And so be it. So... Anholt, Babe Ruth... Augsburg. We could get Augsburg out straight away again. That worked well last time, so we'll do that there. You can maybe come over to be... ...vaguely adjacent to, uh... Arnsbach. And then we'll do that. Give it, like, three months. One. We've lost our bonus diplomat from the 20-year uh, mission thing. Burgers are happy. Can we make you even happier? Not unless we stop doing that and make the Pope happier. Mm, I'm allowed to rival OPM Glossar. That's ridiculous. Rivaling Savoy would seem somewhat reasonable. Venice would also seem reasonable. It's not like I'm ever going to attack. Like, it's not giving me German tags. It's because I have a vassal down here. It's like, you can rival all of these people. 
So be it. Call back. One more month. Do our same little trick. Oh, you're not going to let me do this this time. Okay. Bring even more units across. I'm going to get that to happen again. I really liked doing that. I want to be a march. Tough. Okay. And then as long as we're arriving on the second, we can declare our war on the first. I'm not paying that many ducats for... <clears throat> 7, 8, 9, 10. It's actually 40 prestige. So that's like 80 ducats for 40 prestige. Yeah, okay, I will pay that. Okay, ready, steady. I want to turn you into a subject. Wait, what's happened here? Why is this lower? Well, then I can cobble... Oh, the Teutons have no given up their friendship there. Excellent. Done. So we crush Arnsbach in the opening move. As best we can, given that we are a little bit uh, not so great at the Miltex. You're maxed. Curry. There we go. Oh, I didn't realise everyone would be here. Boo. Boo to running away through multiple forts. They're stopping my coring. Boo. Re-raise here. Come on, either one of these would be nice. Thank you, and thank you. Oh, that's no good. That's really no good.
How did they even get onto your island? You have naval supremacy. Idiot. Yes, I will pay, pay that ducats for that. Two more on that siege. We finally sensible enough to be able to, yes, buy that. And then that. And then I'm thinking we kind of almost need to mill concentrate. Turn you into money. And prestige. And not being friends with Austria, forcing Austria to have a real friend. <sighs> I can give up five ducats. Also, for some more prestige. No. Okay, then we'll keep the extra ducats. Good day, sir. care if Milan hates me a little bit. Think Saxony is the best Saxony? Well, I hope we're best Saxony. He needs some more love. So does our guy. No, he doesn't. I lie. He does not need more love. What about the Pope? Ooh, the Pope does need more love. Uh, who do you hate? No, I could just do this over the year tick, and then we're fine. You do. You definitely do need the China for the China wear. There's a reason it's not called India Ware. Now let's look at what I want. So I want to do this. and force him to be my vassal. After I've given away these two. Chinaware is anything that breaks a few days after you buy it. We could also look at eating Lubeck now. Oh. I'm not meant to be calling back from the Pope because I wanted the year tick. Because then we complete our mission. There we go. Now I can fabricate on Lubeck. Both sides suck. 
No, 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 not you, Lubeck. I don't know that we're ever going to get to use it, because his trade league is actually pretty big. Good. Head to there. Along with those. We might be able to scare them off, or at least get it back really quickly. He's still planning this war against Milan. I, somehow this Switzerland must just be like... Yeah. Anyway, go fix that. You go do some ally insurance, or replace these guys. Yeah, conserve my real manpower. Or not. Go deal with that, then come home. Both of these come home. One of you do ally insurance there. No CB Colne for the colonial range. Huh? What colonial range am I going to get out of that? Oh, colonial range. Okay, okay. I wasn't reading the comment before. It's pronounced colon. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. It's a good future armor episode. Uh, let's not be using our king at war, just at the moment, thank you. Actually, I will do ally insurance, though. Okay, so I wanted to give... He wants it, so he must want this one as well. Let's see if this works. So, we separate piece you for becoming my minion... done. That gives us two minions, so we can pass that our everyone is happier. Which also helps with our Mr. Thuringia, who we can stop paying for the loyalists of now. And then we see if we can do what I wanted here, which was this, this, yes, he will let me give them to him. So I no longer, like if I was trying to, like I did before, do... Oh, I can't vassalize him because it's not his capital now. Hmm. I'd have to do that. Yeah, I didn't think this through enough. Oops. Um... Hmm. I think we just short truce him and use that to vassalize this guy. So now I can do this. And then when I declare on Arnholt, I'll get Brandenburg. So I might as well humiliate and war reps as well. Well, actually, we should money, depending on how my contribution is. My contribution isn't enough. We will war reps. <sighs> Vassalized elector is another malice. But only to other votes. And no one's voting for me anyway. So I don't really... Yeah, that doesn't bother me. I'd rather get these back on the cheap using Reconquest than care about trying to get elected for 15 years.
So war reps and then money. Okay. We can go full core this stuff. If it wasn't already, but it is. We can go push the autonomy down in that stuff, because the rebels are going to occur anyway. Might as well get something out of it. Drag our units across there to be ready to fight them. And start increasing with the new minion. Brandenburg is no longer a valid rival. We get amazing power projection for humiliating, eclipsing, and conquering provinces from Brandenburg and declaring war on Brandenburg. Brandenburg, Brandenburg, Brandenburg. We need to improve with the new minion. And does our claim run out before our truce? Uh, five years. No, nope. that's perfect. As long as you don't ally someone like France in the meantime, we should be fine. These are waiting for those rebels. You can even wait with the champion of the joust, which I use in air quotes because they're really crappy. Austria, how would you like to help me beat up Poland? You would like to help me beat up Poland. That looks pretty good. He'll become the tributary of Ming. He's getting closer to vassalizing, but still not quite. I think we leave him alone and try and get him peacefully then. Rather than attacking into the stupid alliance thing. In which case, I don't want those claims. I do want you to love me. And then I want to see if I can convince Austria to help me attack any of these people as well. No, I like them, he says. He would help me do this war, and that looks pretty sweet. Venice won't honour at the moment, it's just a bunch of little people in Switzerland. Saluzzo, Cyprus, Constance, Switzerland, Salzburg. Yep, I see no reason to delay that war. Not if Austria is going to help. He did give back this province. Which means I can now fabricate there. Although that kind of makes vassalizing him in the future less useful, because now it's only one province to return. I suppose it would also be Rupin. Maybe I just full annex him next time then. He moves his capital back to Berlin. Cancel. Join together. I'm kind of honestly happy for Austria and friends to do all the work in that war. I'll just sit here and wait for the rebels. That is a horrible air. Straight in the bin with you, if we can. With the death of Frederick II, fresh succession disputes have arisen according surrounding the... Oh, come on! This time between Johann Georg I and his brother Ernst. Okay. According to the deeds of Frederick's will, Ernst should be granted the lands of Thuringia and should rule independent from his brother. Again? However, did he learn nothing from his father's stupidity? However, Johann Georg is, the strong, is in the stronger position and would be able to ignore his father's will if he is willing to accept the consequences. No. Thuringia gains 50% liberty desire. What? Lose two dip rep? I don't care. I'm keeping my, my guy. He's mine. I'm never letting him go. You can pry him from my cold, dead hands. 
take a dip tech. And then we'll take another dip rep. And then if we enable the loyalists, he'll be borderline loyal. Ugh, and then I lose a dip rep. Uh, I don't care if Saxony hates me, but losing the dip rep was not really acceptable. What I could do is just say there's never enough cow. Yeah, and then that's fine. <sighs> when we defeat Austria in a war and take his provinces, but he says, un yeah, 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 give it back. You won the war, but give it back. Uh, do we have the technology for... these yet? Anywhere that has food province is going to have to have them because we are desperate. And so much of this is not food type stuff. So this is actually going to be good for a whole bunch of little war reps. Saluzzo, Constance, Salzburg, Switzerland. I'm going to get like four sets of war reps from this. Without the Emperor ship, isn't Bohemia stronger than Austria? At the start date, quite possibly. Especially on very hard, because the vassals would be uh, a lot of strength. But he does have Emperorship. But he does. Uh, come back here and train. In which case, actually, you guard these in case they think of attacking it while they're training. Now, Austria, do you not happen to want some Swiss land? I'd be willing to give you some Swiss land. I'm also willing to say that I hate the Swiss, and that my guy should fabricate on... I can't do that quite yet, but we should do that once the war is over. Okay, you want your freedom. I offer you freedom from your suffering in exchange for money, 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 money. War reps. Money. And some prestige. Now, salute so. In your case, I want your trade power because I don't want you being part of Venice. War reps. Money. A little bit of prestige. Salzburg, Switzerland, and Cyprus. When all his cores returned, he was instantly loyal and happy. Aww. Aww. No, I can't really afford. Can I? If I'm not getting extra money from war reps and stuff. No, I'd rather save that money up to use on buildings. So this is going to go to Milan. I don't want to do this because I would not exist. Back to bribing you. 
at least until we've gotten the last Swiss uh, province siege down. Or this one. Okay. You stop doing that. Give me money. Give us prestige. Austria really likes that. That that repays the favors that we spent calling him in. That seems very worth Done. And then in the future I can maybe feed that, vassalize that, and return those later. Now do I yoink Mantua from him? I think the answer has to be no, because he'd be cataclysmically disloyal. Would you join now a war against Venice? Opinion of enemies. Can we fix that? No. Unfortunately. What about Savoy? Oh, you're trying to kill off Salute, so... Wait, you're friends with the Ottomans? No, you're just doing your own salute, so war. What about your attitude towards there? Oof. Uh, no, I can fix that. So if I've got 20 favours, and I do, I could say, please don't like Savoy. He was now, because he's going to be under uh, under the magic number, he's under 35. Next month he's obliged to turn neutral. There we go. Austria is now neutral. And we can say, help me reconquest Parma. Because I would like even more war reps from rich nations <laughs> uh, that you caused to be given to me, please, Austria. Where are these likely to occur? In Brandenburg? Yeah, yeah. Return cores is worth like 20 per province of... um. You returned my core using the return core menu, so it's really strong to use that way. If you need some extra opinion. Are the South American tribal nations any good? Portugura, Mapuche and all? Uh, only the Incan ones are pretty any good. The others are all just... The others are Brazil waiting to happen. <laughs> they're, they're provinces that will get added to Portuguese Brazil sooner or later. Next one of these. Uh, for the moment, the autonomy change. Eventually we might want the more cultures, but for now, the autonomy change. It kind of looks like we need to go an admin one. Have you happened to go innovative? No. So innovative might still be open. Yes, innovative is still open. What does it combine with? What does it give me? Yep, I can get behind that. Done. Decision made. 
<clears throat> innovative all the way. What else am I going to go? Religious? Admin? Yoink. Build a church. Build a church is very doable. Probably in Brandenburg itself. It's a tall Saxony. We've grown up and down. We could have a look at how much uh, AE this is going to cause. Probably not very much because it's Reconquest. Seven. I could also force you to give that crap to Genoa. But I don't really care that much. I do care about getting him out of the coalition. No, stay stuck. If you're not going to vassalize, why should I let you walk through my lands? Now, unfortunately, that's actually more than I can deal with. And that's not meant to be able to be possible. I'm not meant to be able to have more than my force limit in uh, Rebels these days. Hmm. Hmm. That's like, yeah, very much not meant to be a thing anymore. Because of that horrible patch where you would have two times your force limit worth of rebels and then Paradox said never again. I can get rid of that though. And you still refuse to help. I think I better hop off of here. If the rebels occur, we're going to die. So actually, we will go help with the war. And then we're going to trust Austria to deal with the rebels for me. Goodbye, Prestige, sadly. I don't care, I'm not allowed that. Well... Actually, yes, if I'm starting to do an admin idea group, you know what, yes. Even though they're useless to me, it's basically just saying, do, they, do you want to turn 100 ducats into 100 admin? I do still need to be doing that. I feel like we'd be better off carpet sieging over here.
Wish I had some boats so that I was in a position to push Brittany out. You know what, you can... I was going to say attach to the Austrians. But apparently not so much. There. There. Now look, I don't really want you in this war. If you will leave, I'll let you out. Not yet, they say. This finishes thing will things will definitely turn towards the uh <coughs> leaving side of things. I guess I could try and push you out as well, instead of saying I'm hostile. I would like one more, and then that one, and then we probably have to stop again. Because else our dip tech will get too backwards. Did I just become the emperor when I wasn't looking? Did I just become the papal controller when I wasn't looking? I feel like I have an extra diplomat. Oh, we completed this. Fair enough. Speed up one. <laughs> We're nearly done for pushing Brittany out. 35%. Doo -doo -doo -doo. Come on, 49%. Forty-nine percent fails again. They succeed on my capital, but doesn't matter too too much because capitals can't have autonomy anyway. Thank you. That gets you out. No, nah, we can't get anything else anyway. Done.
<laughs> Top work, Salutso. Wait, you want to eat? Have you developed a taste for Swiss land? Well, he's got a little bit of a taste for Swiss land. I shouldn't <clears throat> have a free diplomat. We should be doing at least something like re-upping with the Pope. And bribing my own guy to like me more. Ugh. Ah, uh, why did... Why did... <sighs> Austria tried retreating in a direction that my units could not apparently go. Even though they had been following the Austrian troops the day before. Like, the fight started. So my, my little Merc stack gets... I'm so sick of losing the baby Merc stack. We're not rebuilding it anymore. We are... Yeah. Well. Yeah, we can rebuild it once more. Start that up again from scratch. No, Austria, you need to help me. Not with that, with this. Please. See if we can tempt them over to help. It looks like we can. Good. Build a workshop is fine. Kill that, then come back. You don't need to attach to me anymore. Well, it is kind of the thing to do, other than forming Austria. So, no shame. No shame, uh, tot Totsutaro. Totsutaro. What else do we need? 